What's up guys, it's Mike from Jersey Connect and today we're going to be taking a look at the Kevin Durant Nike Select MVP Swingman Jersey. These Nike Select jerseys pretty much just celebrate the last decade's MVPs and Rookie of the Year. Kevin Durant won the Rookie of the Year and he's also won MVP, so his jersey is going to be a little different, kind of similar to the LeBron James version. So in today's video, what we're going to do is unbox a jersey, take a closer look at the finer details, and see if this is something that you want to purchase yourself. So if you guys find this video helpful, an easy way to support the channel is just by hitting like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so when I drop new videos, you don't miss out. And quick little side note, if you're interested in this particular jersey, I'm gonna have an affiliate link to fanatics.com in the description below. Let's go ahead and get into it. So, I bought this jersey at fanatics.com for 160 bucks. And right here we got the first look. Boom, look at that. Brooklyn across the chest. It kinda has that, man, looks metallic. That looks dope. You got MVP and Rookie of the Year. And, we have KD. Let's go ahead and take a closer look at it. Starting off at the collar, you have a black collar and they have a stripe of neon green also on the arm openings as well. That looks cool, I like that one. And on the NBA logo, instead of it being heat pressed like usual Swingmans, they are actually embroidered on these Nike Select ones. Look at that, really beautiful. And then when we go to KD, Kevin Durant. So you have that kind of like neon green lettering, neon green stitching. So instead of heat press lettering on regular Swingmans, these Nike Select ones are actually all stitched down. Just look at the stitching. And right over here, when we go to number seven, my favorite number, right down there, you have like a silver, and there's a little gradient change. It's a black, white, kind of grayish. It has that, kind of gives you like a metallic look in the stitching, just beautiful. This is single stitched. And when we go down to the bottom right corner, so it says Easy Money. So Katie goes by the name Easy Money Sniper and that's actually embroidered onto the jersey. That's dope. And then you get a little story. In 2014, we knew we all knew who the real MVP was, KD's mom. Kevin Durant earned top honors after leading the league in scoring for the fourth time and leading his team on a deep playoff run. Bank on KD to continue establishing himself as one of the game's best for years to come. That's easy money. And that's dope, little story. And then when we take a look at the actual like designs and sublimation patterns that they have on the jersey, you can see MVP, you see part of that Nike swoosh. Just, man, the black, white, and gray on this actual jersey looks clean. MVP again, just, man, kind of clean designs. And then you have it throughout the whole jersey base. And that is the back of the jersey. And starting off at the collar on the front side, you have the same style black with the neon green stripe arm openings you got the same thing and when we go to the neck label you see where the nba logo is embroidered they move the information off center medium guatemala dry fit pretty standard stuff you got your nike tags dry fit nba uh, the recycle tags and your price point medium 160 bucks and when we go to the Nike swoosh, so instead of the heat press Nike swoosh, this is all embroidered onto the jersey. I like how this neon green swoosh, it makes it pop on a darker jersey. Looks clean. And when we go to Brooklyn and the numbering, so you get that gradient change. I like that it kind of gives you like a robotic or like metallic look all stitched down. And the numbering, you have the same style as well. Just single stitched, gradient changes. And my favorite part of the jersey, you get the jock tag and these embroidered like MVP and Rookie of the Year. So since KD won MVP, you got MVP and that's embroidered onto the jersey and Rookie of the Year as well. Wow, look at that. And then on the jock tag, 
it's gonna say select, but you have your typical jock tag. And then right here, it says all decade, 2011, 2020, MVP. And then KD signature as well, right down there. And then just taking a look at the polyester base, just looking at these designs right through there. Oh, I just noticed they had a different polyester piece, kind of like the Brooklyn Nets, uh, forgot what jersey, but they have the same kind of like side panel. It could have been the earned edition. I can't remember off the top, but it's a separate polyester piece. And it has like these arrow, kind of like arrow down type design. And that's on these side panels. And that is the front of the jersey. And this is what it looks like when you wear it. It's on 5'6", 175 pounds. Usually I go between a medium or large. Medium is more form fitting, as you can see. Not too much chest room, but it gives you that athletic fit. If you want to go a size up, you'll get a little more relaxed fit and just more chest room and things like that. But this is the front of the jersey right here. Look at this. Ooh. And then we've got the side panel right here. You see that stripe? And then you get these little side splits on these jerseys right here. Side panel on this side. Then you've got the back of the jersey. And that's the jersey. What's nice about these Nike Select jerseys are the upgraded features. So you get embroidered patches like this. These patches here, really durable, the way they like made these. Man, these are really nice. And then you get stitched down lettering and numbering instead of the heat press. So you get everything upgraded. Like this one back here, the NBA logo stitched down. The story right here. That's actually a dope feature. So I'm actually really into these Nike Select jerseys. And on this particular Nike Select jersey, I like the way that the lettering and numbering look metallic. It just looks like a sleek jersey. And then the neon green makes it pop. Like, it is a great combination. What do you guys think about the jersey? Let me know in the comments. And uh, thank you guys for watching again. And woo, look at this. On to the next one.